Alright, welcome back. Hi. Crack that egg open, bro. Did I say it right? Crack uh, that egg open, bro. I think so. So we're about to we're we're diving into these fucking holes, aren't we? Mm-hmm. We need to find uh we need to find that big old boss man. Well, there's one that didn't get the piss. <laughs> They're laughing at him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Like the uh, the guy from uh, what's the what's hello? The, oh, Nelson. Yeah. <laughs> the, uh, the Simpsons movie was on on uh, my parents' t television one. Really? I can't. Uh, I don't know. I think my dad was just scrolling through certain channels and, but it was on and uh, it was at that part where like Bart's naked, tied yeah. up. And he's just like. Ah! Yeah. And he like does it all day, and then his mom comes and starts doing it to him. <laughs> <laughs> I think the basis for that was Matt Groening, the creator of The Simpsons, was at an airport, and like something humili humiliating happened to him, and a kid laughed just like that at him. Like when he was younger. Yeah. That's hilarious. And like it just stuck with him. What's a what are those little? Shiny These? Key? Yeah, can you fuck with those or is it just like aesthetic stuff? Light mushrooms. Yeah. God, we use them. That hurt my eyes for some reason. I think we've been staring. I think I've been staring at the TV for too long. <laughs> I think that's it. I think this. it's hurting my eyes. Oh. Oh wait, no, it says the names. That's right. Yeah. Is, is this all that's down here? Uh, in this level, right? Yeah. Oh, is there another? Okay. Yeah. Yep. There's another hole. Fucking drop down, bro. Get well, down. I want to make sure I got everything. Because it always sucks. Uh, any game where you think you cleared something, then it shows you the stats. You're like, oh, you missed this. Yeah. Good job, idiot. Good one, idiot. Delve deeper with your. He pigment. sounded like uh, Squisgar Squidelf from Metalocalypse. Is that what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, was, he's uh, Swedish. I was quoting a. Uh, fuck. What is it? For? I don't know who, who the band is, but it was the people who did like the 55 song. Here, I'll look it up. 55. It was a uh, like you've never heard the. Here, I'll look it up. 50. 50. Yeah, there it is. A group X. So group X did the Mario cover. Alex and I played it before. The Mario Twins? Here, listen to this. I'll play it through here. Guess what, idiot? Listen. Good place. <laughs> That's what I was singing. <laughs> and they do the Mario theme like that. They just they just do vocals. Do you oh, I think I do know what He's you're like, talking do, do, about. Do. Like, and they make weird noises. Is that a lighter? Is that... I don't know. No, cool. Did they kill the fire? Wow, they didn't know they could do that. <laughs> I'm going to kill this fire, too. Oh, you little purple guys. Look how dumb Louie looks. They are fucking that up. I wish you could just punch fire so that it goes away. I guess if you're man enough, you could do it. You could. Yeah. You ever put out a candle just by licking your fingers and doing the thing where you squeeze it? No, because I'm a big old puss. Yeah, I'm scared of it too. Oh, God, get away. Purple, guys. Shoo. Burn, baby, burn. Ooh, look at that effect. It's cool. A little fire effect. Watch. Watch Louie. Oh, the heat wave? Yeah, it's yeah, cool. Yeah, cool. Uh, I remember Wind get, Waker. Get that. Wind Waker did that too. Oh, yeah, they did. That's like a, I don't know, whenever I see that in real life, like on the ground or something, like when it's really hot out, mm -hmm. I always get like, I'm like, oh, hey, that's the thing they do in video games. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> like I'm basing like real life off of yeah. things I've seen <laughs> in video games. What is, what is that? What is Oh, it's a domino. Is it? I think, right? Yeah, I think, I think you're right. I think it's supposed to be a domino. Oh, my God. <laughs> you're going to start flying over there. <laughs> is there no, okay, yeah. I thought I was at a dead end. Hell nah, bro. Gotta go kill all that fire. Switch with your D-pad. With your, what's it called? The Stone of something? God. Uh oh. Uh oh. Stone of Glory. That's what it's called. Stone of oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what your D-pad is. That's how you swap them out. Uh oh. Okay, good. Dang. You're just like... Trucking along. Yeah. Well, okay, never mind. Wow, this game's long. Sh what the fuck? Strife Monolith. Monolith? All right. What is that supposed to be? I don't know. Look up Strife Monolith. Make sure that thing is a domino. Strife. It's gonna pop up, I bet, right away. Yep. Nope. Monolith. Yep, there it is. Alright. It's a Mahjong nah. tile. Okay, it's it something. Thing? Yeah, something in Japanese. Yeah, it looked like it. Here's another thing. Is that an old, old Nintendo game? Like oh, it's in the computer. In the, the fuck, what are the compact discs, right? Yeah, doesn't that roll? That's really cool. Was that a thing? Or no, you're thinking um, floppy disk. Yeah, I'm thinking of a floppy disk. Yeah. Is that a CDI thing? I guess it was. <laughs> they really wanted to acknowledge that? <laughs> there you go. Fucking grab them all. Yep. 79 out of the required 15. You're just fucking, you're an overachiever, huh? Yep. Did you ever overachieve ever in like school and stuff? Oh, of course. What'd you ever achieve on? Uh, a lot of stuff, like in college, just 
Like I had to turn in like a term paper, you know? And yeah. I'd put one of those little plastic slip covers over it. <laughs> yeah. Just pretty good. Presentation. Presentation goes a long way. I uh I think the best thing I ever we we there was one class that I had, it was a uh, science class. I'm not sure what it was specifically. But um we had a all semester to finish a project. Like they mm -hmm. were like, Here we're telling you what it is first day. Yeah. And you have all semester to get it done. You can do it at any rate that you want to, but it has to be done by the last day. Cosmic archive. That's pretty cool. Yeah. But um sounds stressful. Within the first week there was a um day that my roommate and I like he had to go to the library and he, we just stayed there super late mm -hmm. and um I was there until 3:30 a.m. because I just view. Oh cool. Yeah. I was there until 3:30 a.m. because I just got in the groove of working on it that I just wanted to get it done and I yeah. spent like f 5 or 6 hours in a row just like getting it done. Damn. And I finished it like in, within like the first week of uh the entire semester and I never had to touch it again. That's awesome. And I think it was like the final. Like I think we didn't have a, a test. They were just like the project was the test. Yeah. So, it was very nice. I think, that, I think just getting ahead of yourself like that is very Remember nice. Remember how stressful group projects were? I, th that's all college was, and I, I guess how a, just a massive pain in the dick they are. It's because... It's very dumb, because in college, like, they force you to do group projects, but no one has the same schedule at all. No. So it's so hard to meet up with people and shit. Yep. And it's if given the option, like, you can do group project or work by yourself. It's like, I'm by myself. Given the option, I would do it, online classes the entire time. And I never did an online class. Oh, they're the best. Really? Yeah, because you can do everything at your own pace. Hey, look at that. Oh, cool. Is that a Game & Watch? Yes, it is. I never had one. Me That's either. <laughs> Why did you just shit it out? <laughs> I don't know. How do you fit that thing in them? Yeah. Look at you carrying shit. No, um, yeah, I took online classes, and they were great. Yeah, I never did. I would, I would 100% recommend them, because you just fucking you sit at home, you get an email saying like, "Hey, this is the only thing that's bad about it is you don't know, never get that satisfaction." Oh, dream architect, what the fuck? Um, you never get the satisfaction of that email from your professor saying, "Hey, uh, class is canceled. Don't come in." That was all. Oh good yeah, <laughs> dude, that rolled. Unless it was like your middle class. Yeah, I always had. And it's like, god damn it. I never had classes canceled my first like three years, which were like days that I'd have to go into class Monday through Friday. Yeah. And then my senior year, I only had to go in Tuesdays and Thursdays for classes. Yeah. And when they got canceled, I would have like one day of classes a week, so I'd have That's six crazy. days of just not nothing. Yeah. <laughs> That's like, there were some good things about college that I missed, but there, yeah, for me as a professor, I had some really cool professors that, like, I still text back and forth with today. Um. My sculpture professor rules. Like he's in like punk rock and metal and shit. And did you ever uh, finish that one sculpture you're working on? You had no, that Star I Wars didn't. One, right? Yeah, it dried out. And oh get yeah, it. that sucks. sucks. Yep. <laughs> Just <laughs> slurped in there. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Oh, look at it's that. a playing card. Oh yeah. Is that a uh, is that a bicycle playing card? No, it's a Nintendo. Nintendo. Yeah, it's fun they fact. To, yeah, they used to make toys and shit. Well, no, bicycle playing cards are based out of Cincinnati. Oh, that is a fun fact. Yep. No, I was gonna say that uh, Nintendo used to make like toys and shit before they were. Yeah, a they were company. a trading card company like decades before they created games. They created like board games and stuff too. That would be cool to Nintendo have. Nintendo board game. Like a, like an original Nintendo board game. <laughs> Can they hop over the fire? Yeah. <laughs> like, did you, like, did you ever bet? Have you ever bet your friend like? You think I can run over this fire? Like you're at like a bonfire or something? You yeah. have to, like jump over it real quick <laughs> and then it gets all hot. <laughs> yeah, sacrifice the red Pikmin. Well, I mean, at least you give birth. Yeah. I like to think that you're not sacrificing them; they just become purple become ones. Become something else. They're yeah. still, they're still the red ones in their brains, but they're just stronger now. Yeah, they're stronger and fatter. That's like if I got tossed into a volcano or something and then came out like blue, and then I could fly. I'd be like, cool. Hell yeah, that'd be <laughs> awesome. <laughs> no, because then the government would like take you and then do luck tests wafer. On you. Luck wafer. I'd take that trade off, like blue skin, but I can fly. Yeah, but then would, the government would hunt you down, and then I would just get rid of my car. I'm going to work. <laughs> if you became a superhero, it would suck because you know there'd be a villain out there that you'd have to go fight eventually. Yeah. <laughs> that would suck. That's how it works. Yeah. There, you can't just be, you can't just have a power. Yeah. It was you like have to fight crime. Tony Stark said, like, after I came around, all this bad shit started happening. Is that coincidence? No. Can you go lower? Are we done? Yeah, no, we're still going. How many sub-levels are there on this fucking I'm cave? telling you, when I, the first time you went in, I said there was like... Some of these have like ten sub levels. They're huge. I think that's it on this level. But at least when you get to the end, it just teleports you back to the top, right? Yeah. That'd be so annoying if you had, you had to, to go keep back going. up level by level. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that would be a very Nintendo thing to do. Uh, do we have to go? Uh, yeah. I think we can hop on out of here. So, 
Um, right, we're going to well, hop out of here, as then we're going to hop down into that level. Let's do it. In the next episode. All right. Goodbye, everyone. Bye. <laughs>